Hey guys, I want to welcome you to my new house. Um, it's still the blank canvas version of it, um, but I wanted to show you the before so that once we're done, you can check out the after. Come on in. So here we are, this is the entryway, or AKA foyer, or foyer. So this whole section we're gonna be redoing, we're redoing the floors, for sure, um, but also the staircase. Um, we're gonna stain the steps to match whatever floor we do, and also I'm gonna get um, custom railing done as well. So this is just the before. Hey guys, welcome back to my house. Um, we wanted to do a video of the progress that's been going on since the last time you guys were here to check out what our plans were and things that we were about to do and change and fix and replace. And um, since then we've made some additions and changes because once you get into the construction period, your mind grows and you get more creative and think of new ideas. For example, here in the foyer, we decided to add these balconies. Um, they're called Romeo and Juliet balconies to, that's actually the guest room up there. And the other one is my son's bedroom. And they will have French doors, with smoky glass and there will be railing there to match um, the rest of the railing, which we do have one little sample here. It's an idea of what will be happening. Also, we will be replacing our front door and window. Um, we're gonna be getting this iron door, which actually is gonna match the railing for the staircase. So it's gonna be super beautiful, but it's definitely, you know, a lot of work. Welcome back guys. We finally have the finished product to show you. Welcome to my foyer. And this is definitely one of my favorite designs, the foyer. I feel like it all comes together so well. We have the custom hand railings with of course R&R at the very top of it. We completely customized the steps. We changed each step to be more square for that more modern look and we painted the top of the step to match the rest of the floor with the white flooring and the risers black to give it an even more dramatic look. Of course, we added the gold into the black railing for a little bit of contrast and then I added that into my floor design as well. I knew I wanted to continue the wood look from the rest of the floor, but I wanted the foyer to have a tile as well. So we have this beautiful black and white um, porcelain tile. Looks like marble, but a little bit less expensive and still just as beautiful. And of course I had to add the gold little trim, which gives it the contrast between that wood floor and the black and white marble floor. Like I said, we designed this floor into this beautiful crisscross look which perfectly matches the railing we have the two balconies that we added with the trim around we have the sconces on the side of the balconies balcony number one balcony number two which is my son's room mr pasha even this chandelier is custom this chandelier came with only three tiers and we added this fourth tier by actually putting two sconces together and adding that layer to make it a little bit longer and again, more luxurious. The ceiling uh, is also custom. It's a coffered ceiling that we designed. It has this octagon shape around the chandelier, which is a little bit of another theme that's going on in the house. We have the octagon shape in my living room and we added that idea in a more rounder way in the foyer. So we have a lot of shapes going on in this house. So the only thing we actually did reuse from the, the initial version of this home was this handrail. We decided to keep it and we painted it into this glossy black um, finish but we did change the each step and obviously the railings 
and this railing is 100% custom made and if you need any metal work or any railings my company does that as well so I can assist you in designing and then actually creating whatever perfect railing you need and we wanted to add a little touch because my name is Romina my husband's name is Roman Roman and Romina hence R and R designs so the most grandest part of this house is the entryway door it takes up the entire wall so we completely broke the wall broke the door took out the window that was in there and created this grand entryway which makes a huge statement if anybody wants a custom door and you can get this at any size with any design we can help you get your dream door. Mm -hmm.